since FM is uh, basically the, uh, the AM of today, we decided to use FM frequencies instead, so this isn't exactly a completely traditional performance. The second player um, controls the volume or the amplitude. Despite this very specific look of the score, because the radio station will change based on the city you happen to be in and the time you happen to be performing it, the sound will be completely different, of course. And this is an example of Cage relinquishing more and more control in his compositions. And this is one way that um, he described the process. In his book, Silence, he writes of this piece, it is thus possible to make a musical composition the continuity of which is free of individual taste and memory and also of the literature and traditions of the art. The sounds enter the time space centered within themselves, unimpeded by service to any abstraction. They're 360 degrees of circumference, free for an infinite play of interpenetration. Wow. Value judgments are not in the nature of this work as regards either composition, performance, or listening. The idea of relation being absent, anything may happen. A mistake is beside the point. For once anything happens, it authentically is.